So similar to other studies, we found that treatment of, with rasburicase has led to a statistically significant uh, reduction in uric acid levels compared to allopurinol. However, we did not find that there was a statistically significant improvement in the incidence of renal recovery compared to allopurinol. This is important not only for uh, clinical um, understanding of the use of rasburicase, but also for a cost-effective analysis, fully knowing that treatment with rasburicase is much more expensive compared to allopurinol. Um, our study also did show that there was a trend towards benefit of using rasburicase in patients with high risk for TLS versus those at low to intermediate risk, which is um, uh, consistent with our knowledge of the indications of use for rasburicase. And we feel like the adherence to these guidelines is very important and, um, and should drive physician judgment in terms of when to use rasburicase and adhering to the guidelines that are already in place.